Hi, today we're going to do a fall art project. For this activity, you'll need some paint. You'll need some tools and you'll need to collect some leaves or limbs from outside. Let's get started. So at the school, I went for a walk and I found some things that might be nice on a paper. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose first some pine needles. I'm going to lay them across my paper any way you would like. And I'm going to use a tool. So I think for this one, I'm going to try a paintbrush and maybe I'm going to dip it in a little bit of brown. I don't want too much paint and I'm going to dab it on top of the needles. over there. I'm going to pick it up. And I'm going to have a little design on my paper. Next, I'm going to pick a leaf. Now, I noticed that when you choose a leaf that is more subtle, supple, which means it still has some bend in it, it might be easier for this project. A lot of the leaves I found at school are already dried up from falling off the leaves from some time ago, so they may be more challenging to use. So when you're looking for them, try to find the ones that are soft on the ground. So what if I take my leaf this time I'm going to try a toothbrush. Why don't I try a little bit of green? We're going to dab it on the outside edges of the leaf. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to make a shadow, kind of a, an outside shadow of our leaves or our limbs that we find outside. Let's see how this turns out when we're all done. Mostly it's just a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun to go for a walk and collect things in nature. It's a lot of fun to paint. Try to get my stem over here. Okay, let's see. I'll put my tool over here. I'm gonna pick up this one. There it is. I can see the outside of my leaf. Let's see. Oh, let's try this one. Let's try this little branch. This time I think maybe I'm gonna use this, it's actually a paint. It's actually a brush for, it's a powder brush for putting on makeup. So let's see, maybe I'll try some yellow this time. Let's see what happens. Same thing, you're gonna hold it down and you're just gonna dab it on top. Just on top, tiny little dabs. We don't want too much paint. Let's see if we can see the silhouette. I can see it. I see all these great colors happening. Let's let's try one more. Let's try let's try this one. This one's kind of pokey. So you don't have to use the whole thing. You could just pick a section of it. So I think I'll use a brush. And I haven't used orange yet. So maybe I'll do a little orange. Let's see if I can't dab the outside of this one a little bit. Let's see if I can make some silhouette marks the outside of our needles here, our pine needles. Hey, that was a school bell. When you come into school with us in class, you'll hear that bell sometimes. Okay, I'm gonna stop there and pick that up. Maybe knock off some of my needle pieces here. Off my paper. And I can see that it made a really cool design. And my last one, if you don't have brushes at home, what else could you use for a tool? Fingers. Your fingers are tools. So what color haven't I used yet? That's right, red. So I'm going to dip my finger in red. And the same thing, I'm just going to dab on the outside of the leaf. So if you'd like to touch your paint, you can do all of it with your fingers if you would like to. You can do as many as you want or as few as you want. Fall is a fun time of year because lots of things end up on the ground that we can collect and look at. In our playground, a lot of times we'll see lots of acorns in our playground. Those are kind of fun to collect with a bucket and collect those acorns. Those squirrels like those acorns, but acorns aren't made for people. If people eat acorns, you can get sick. So we never put acorns in our mouth, but squirrels like them. So sometimes we collect those 
and we stick them somewhere in the playground later on in a bunch and the squirrels come and eat them. They love it. I'm almost done. Okay, let's see how that one looks. And there you go, friends. There's some fun fall art for you. Have fun at home creating whatever you want.